welcome back here to the fourth session for the knee series here now i want you to make sure you have your theraband but also notice i have some dumbbells so if you have dumbbells make sure that you have those if you don't have them with you right now hit pause and go grab them real quick because we're going to be building some strength in the knees today with those weights now we're going to start off as we normally do with that nice little march here so again lifting those legs nice and high. Again, we'll go through that same little warm up here where we swivel the leg and we swing those hips around. And again, like I said, we're building some strength with some dumbbells today along with that theraband. So again, let's march it here for three, two, one. And let's bring that leg right on up. Let's swivel the lower leg. Again, this leg stays right where it is. And we'll go three, two, one and other direction again swivel it around and around again we'll go three two one and let's switch it now other side lift this leg up swivel that lower leg again around and around we're warming up those joints taking care of our knees and we'll go three two one and other direction again spin it around and around and again this is an excellent exercise right here for arthritis again we're moving that joint we're moving it all over the place and that is the best for arthritis we'll go three two one let's grab those hips let's spin it around and around to loosen everything up and we're gonna go three and two and one other direction again spin it around and around and we'll go three two one and now i want you to kick this leg up and reach across again reaching across seeing if you can touch that toe again we're going to kick it up bring it down again feel that stretch right behind your leg again we're also working this upper quad and we're going to go three two one and let's switch it now to the other side again we're reaching with our opposite arm we're extending that leg up here and we're going to go five four and see if you can touch your toe we got two more last one excellent job now i want you to bring this leg just like this what i want you to do is try to raise it up and down again you're really activating this quad it should be straight right here raise it up as high as you can again raising it up bring it down raising it up and down and we'll go five this is a tough one four three two one and again excellent job with that let's switch it right on over here again this leg straight this toe is back we're raising it up and we'll go up and down again lift it up as high as you can again this is a very tough exercise and the stronger your quad is the higher you will lift it up here and again you just want to bring it down to that straight position and lift it up nice and high and we'll go two one more and now bring both these legs let's kind of activate this core a little bit again we're sitting up nice and straight we're working on quads we're working on our hamstrings we're working on our abs and now i want you to bring those arms out just like this and we'll go three two one and again excellent job now i want you to grab onto both of your dumbbells here we're going to place them right on our legs now i want you to bring this leg up hold it right there we're going to hold it for 10, 9, again, a nice long hold. Try to make it so your leg does not drop. If anything, raise it up higher. We're going to go 3, 2, 1, an excellent job. Now, other side, again, we're raising it up. Our toes should be flexed. Our leg is nice and high. Our weight is just resting right on there. we got 10 more seconds, so make sure that leg isn't dropping. Again, squeeze those muscles, and we're going to go 3 two one and excellent job now i want you to bring this leg up and what you're going to do is you're just going to bend that leg so again you're not bringing it all the way straight you're just lifting your leg up just like we did we're just extending and bringing it back again this is for that range of motion through the knee again only extend it as far as it feels comfortable again we're working on our hamstring here we're working our quads we're working that whole leg to protect that knee that burns and we're gonna go three two one and excellent job now let's bring it right on over here again we're lifting this leg up we're just extending that lower part of the leg or other part 
should not be moving. Those muscles should be working right where that dumbbell is. But again, we're lifting it up. We're holding it there. We're extending this leg forward and bringing it back. Again, keep moving. I know this one's tough. We're going to go five and four, three, two, one. And now let's just alternate those legs. Again, we're raising them up as high as we can here. And we're going to go 10, nine. Again, really lift them up. Really squeeze that core. Try to sit up nice and straight. And we're going to go four, three, two, one. And again, excellent job. Keeping those dumbbells right where they are. I want you to bring this leg up just like this. We're just going to swivel it again. We're going to go out. And in again, always in control. We're gonna go 10, nine. Again, this is working that outer thigh. It's working that inner thigh, protecting that whole knee here. We're gonna go five and four. Keep that leg up nice and high. Three, two, one, and excellent job. Now right up here again, always in control. We got that leg lifted up. We're going out. And in here again, working those inner thighs, working those outer thighs, really working around that whole lower body. And again, this is great for the hips, for anyone that's got different hip issues. It's a great exercise for that. Again, keep it up nice and high. We're going to go four and three, two. I know it burns. Last one. And let's come right back to that nice high march here. And we're going to go 10. Nine, lift them up nice and high, and we're gonna go six, five, great work, and four, three, two, one, and excellent job. Now I want you to set down those dumbbells right on next to you. What I want you to do is just gonna run it out in place here again, move your body, kind of loosen everything up, and we're gonna go three, two, one, and let's bring those legs up and down here, and again, we're gonna slightly pause as I'm doing these. So again, when I say stop, you're going to hold those legs up and stop, hold it. Good work. You can squeeze those muscles, squeeze that core. And we're going to go three, two, one, and bringing it up and down again. Again, we're getting the blood flowing throughout that whole body, getting it out of these muscles, but stop and hold it. Nice job. Again, pay attention here. You can squeeze these muscles, sit up straight in three, two, one. And we're going one more time. Up and down with those legs here, and we're gonna go five, four, three, two, one, hold it up. Good work. Again, squeeze that core, squeeze these legs, squeeze down here. We're gonna go three, two, one, and again, excellent job with that. Now, I want you to grab onto that TheraBand. We're gonna work on this calf muscle here, and I want you to wrap it around just like that. Now, from here, I just want you to extend, and we're gonna hold it right there. We're gonna hold it for five, four, three, two, one, and now let's bring it back, and we're gonna go five, four, three, moving that foot, and two, one. Now hold it out there, squeeze that calf, again, squeeze those muscles. Try to keep this leg nice and straight for three, two, one and now move that leg back and forth here again feeling the resistance we're going to go three two one hold it out again pointing that toe straight forward and three two one and let's move it one more time for three two one and excellent job now again you can kind of tap those muscles right back there sometimes those calves get a little tight but let's move right to the other side we're going to bring this leg up just like this. Again, we're going to extend it out. We're going to hold it there for five, four, three, two, one. And we're going to bring it back and forward for five, four, three, two. Hold it out. Again, for five, four, three, two, one. And bringing it back. And we'll go five, four, three, two, one. One and one more time through that, hold it forward, and you should really start to feel it right in the backs of those legs, and we'll go three, two, one, and bringing it back and forth here, and we'll go three, two, one, and excellent job with that. Now I want you to wrap that band right around the front, the top and bottom of those feet, and we're just gonna go from this side and bring it in. Again, these are nice and slow motions. Again, with this, slow is the key. 
We're controlling the outward motion. We're controlling the in. We're going to switch it over here. Again, nice and slow through these motions. Really control it. Really tighten up your core. Again, sit up nice and straight. We're going to go five and four. Again, feel the burn in those legs. And three and two. We'll do one more over there. And excellent job with that. Now, what I want you to do is just put that band right aside. You're going to stand that up. We're going to stand up just a few times here, up and down. So again, arms are forward. Let's go ahead and have a stand up and sit back down. And then we'll stand on up and we'll sit back down. Again, three more here. We'll go up and down. Again, two more. We'll go up and down and one more time here up and we'll go back down but we got to stand that up because we're going to stay up here and i want you just to go right to the side of your chair we're going to work on some range of motion right from here so holding right onto this chair bring your outside leg up holding it right there and we're going to swivel it very slow circles here and we're going around and around again i want you to use your chair no matter how good your balance is because the main focus here is this leg taking care of the knee and we're going to go three two one and you can bring it right back down but we're going to bring it on up we're going to spin it the other direction so again we're going around and around here we're going to go three again feel that in these legs two one and excellent job now i want you to go to the other side of your chair here same thing outside leg comes up we're spinning it around and some nice big circles here again the bigger the better here for this range of motion throughout the whole lower body and we're going to go three two one and you can bring it down to rest we're going to bring it up and we're going to bring it the other direction around here again feel these muscles working and we're going to go three two one and excellent job now i'm going to turn just like this and we're going to start going up and down on those toes and we're going to go 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 now hold it up there for 5 4 3 2 1 and i'm going to turn just like this because we're going to bring these legs up as high as we can here working on this range of motion and we're going to go 10 9 8 7 6 5 again raise them up as high as you can and 2 1 and excellent job with that now let's stretch out these backs of the legs so this leg comes forward that heel goes down you can push in to that chair to stretch those muscles and we'll go three one and then switch it now other side again this leg goes forward that knee goes that way that heel goes down and we're going to stretch for three two really push into that chair one and again excellent job i'm going to stay just like this because we're going to bring this leg up just like this again as high as you can if you can grab it grab onto it again make sure you don't have anything around you that you can trip on and use this chair and if you can't bring it up that high, bring it up as high as you can. And we'll go three, two, one. And again, excellent job. Now I'm going to switch. I'm going to bring this leg up. Again, bring it up as high as you can. Again, we're stretching that quad. We're going to go three. Really feel that stretch. Two, one. And now, nice job. Now I want you to bring this leg right on forward. We're going to reach down. And we're going to try to touch that toe. We're going to hold on to the chair here, wiggle those fingers, and we'll go three, two, one, and again, excellent job. I'm going to flip now to the other side here. I'm going to bring this leg right on forward. I'm going to reach on down and get holding on to the chair, and I'm going to go five, four, three, two, one and allow yourself to come on up and we're going to have a seat right on back down and we're going to bring this leg right up here to stretch out those hips so again bring it right up here 
Give it a good squeeze. Really stretch this out. We're going to go three, two, one. And now let's switch it right to the other side again. Find a little stretch here and give it a good pull. We're going to go three, two, one. And I want you to bring those legs down. I want you just to move your body here. You're going to move your legs this way and move it this way. Bring them on forward. Bring them on back. You can move those legs. Let's get the blood flow in here. And we're going to go three, two, one. And let's take a deep breath in. And exhale. So again, another excellent workout there. Again, an excellent session for the knees. Again, we're building up all of those muscles. Now I want you to head to the next session for the next time that you do this knee series. It's very important. 